And I spent two weeks at Al-Aqsa Hospital, um, and I think it's fair to say I wasn't remotely prepared for what I, was, what I saw. I saw um, the most appalling atrocities, uh, and I saw things that I never would have expected to have seen in any healthcare setting. I saw things at Al-Aqsa Hospital which I still wake up at night thinking about, uh, appalling injuries in particularly women and children, uh, the, the, the most devastating burns in small children. One child that I'll never forget had burns so bad you could see her facial bones. We knew there was no chance of her surviving that, but there was no morphine to give her. So not only was she inevitably going to die, but she would die in agony. And what made it even worse, that there was nowhere for her to go and die. So she was just left on the floor of the emergency department to die. And that's just one story. We've all seen multiple stories like that. <laughs>